Welcome to another video in Travel Small Live Big's Campground Favorite Series and welcome to Lake Foss Point State Park in St. Martinville, Louisiana. We are right on the bayou <laughs> and this is our own little private deck. It is also super bright out here, but hey, if this is your first or 27th time visiting our channel, please consider subscribing for more videos in this series. Hi, I'm Heather. This is Jim, and this is Sierra, our rescue pup. She is a handful. We've lived what would be considered an alternative lifestyle for 30 years, on sailboats. We slowly moved up, cruised the west coast of Mexico twice, and now, for the first time in many years, are boatless. The three of us are full-time in our small travel trailer. We started our adventure in our R-Pod 177, and then moved up to our Imagine 17 MKE. We are Travel Small, Live Big. Join us as we share our new RV, our campground information videos, and our exploring of the United States. This Louisiana State Park encompasses 6,000 acres of wetlands, bayous, canals, and islands, and it is amazing. The park has a campground, cabins, two tenter sites, backpack sites, and a canoe site. There's a beautiful day use area, a playground, a splash pad, launch ramp, hiking trails, and canoe trails. The campground offers 50 sites, I believe 12 with full hookups, many with partial hookups, and then the really cool waterfront sites. We had site number 31 with water and electricity, bayou front with our own little private deck over the water, and in February of 2022 with reservation fee, tax, and our awesome geezer discount, averaged just under $15 a night for our four night stay. A bathhouse with laundry facilities is centrally located. There are 18 very cool waterfront cabins, three of which are pet friendly. And trails, the three quarter mile Armadillo Ridge, the 1.6 mile Cardinal Run, and the 3.3 mile Barred Owl Trek. That trail was very wet and swampy. I did a little bit of it, but that trail does take you to the Backpack Inn campsites. The Armadillo Trail gives great views of the marsh, wetlands, and waterways. The Cardinal Run Trail includes a scenic overlook to the west, a favorite spot for me as it was the only place I could get cell service. Cardinal Run falls along the water, nice views, bald cypress, palmettos, and some turtles. The park is also close to the town of New Iberia, a favorite of author James Lee Burke. He spent his childhood summers in the Burke home on East Main Street and uses many of the buildings and locations in his Dave Robichaux mystery series and calls New Iberia's Main Street the most beautiful Main Street in the country. He was one of my mom's favorite authors and is one of Jim's favorite authors as well. So, a day trip to New Iberia. And a stop at Avery Island first, home of Tabasco. We are at Avery Island in Louisiana at the Tabasco plant. They have a restaurant, a museum, a gift shop, a little tour. We have the dog with us, so we're just gonna check out the museum quickly and the store. And the thing that we both noticed the second we got out of the car was the smell of Tabasco. Very vinegary and peppery. 
with the dog along for the day. We skipped the museum and self-guided tour. I did do the gift shop, tasted jalapeno, and then raspberry chipotle infused ice cream. Both, surprisingly, really good. We shared a cup of the raspberry chipotle, bought a couple of things, including a Tabasco dog collar for Sierra. Then a walk on New Iberia's commercial part of Main Street. We missed most of the old houses, but enjoyed reading the plaques explaining the history of the buildings. And apparently they had recently had a Mardi Gras parade in town as trees and stoplights had beads hanging from them and Sierra was enjoying trying to eat candy off the sidewalks. We stopped at the bookstore, Books Along the Tesh, and bought a James Lee Burke book, which, if you're big fans, she has signed copies. So the pros about Lake Foss Point State Park and Campground, the trails, the bayous, the long campsites, our own private deck over the bayou, the birds, bird songs that we've never heard, the animal life and sounds, they're a bit foreign to us here. I love the plant life here, the smells, the water, and I'm just really enjoying the different landscape. Cons, no sell at our site, and extremely limited in and out on a scenic overlook. Other than that, nothing. Another thing to keep in mind, we're here in February, so the trees are really bare. If you've enjoyed this look at Lake Foss Point State Park, give us a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already done so, and leave us a comment so we know that you were here. Stick around for a little more of Louisiana. And as always, thanks for watching.